Good day, mates. Um, some of you may have seen this on the shelf, the one-shot lettering enamel in the pearlescence, and you've wondered, gee, what does that look like? And maybe you bought it, and you didn't like the way it came out because it's very transparent and didn't quite look the way you wanted it to look. But what I do with this paint, it to me, being that it is transparent, I use it like a candy, whereas what I do is I'll mask off um, a section of uh, graphics or lettering, and I'll put one-shot lettering enamel, regular, you know, do a fade, a shade, or whatever, and then after that tacks up, I will take the pearlescence and airbrush directly on top of that while it's still kind of wet, and really lay it on heavy. In fact, when I airbrush with this, it's, um, it's pretty thick and I run the air compressor kind of high to push out the paint. But this way you get that uh, heavy, the metal flakes to uh, flow really nice on there. And it looks really good when you're done. It, it, it's got that little glittery uh, pearlescent to it. And it makes a little uh, stripe or lettering just pop even more. I'll show you a truck I did yesterday with the same effect and um, it might not even show up with the video because it, it's not the same as looking at the real thing. But uh, just to give you an idea of that that's how I do it. Uh -huh. Pearlescent and like I said you, you can't really tell in the little uh, video how it looks in the sun unless you really get up on it. Also. This little center green panel is done with the pearlescence. Maybe right there it might show it. I don't know. Kind of hard to show up on the little video. But, um, and you got the uh, aluminum leaf on top. Pretty sweet, huh? But that's how I use the uh, one shot uh, pearlescent. It has, like I said, a uh, uh, transparent look to it. Okay, so I'm all done with the truck now. As you can see, I got the. Um, the stripe done and the other pin striping and the lettering and stuff and maybe this side shows the uh, pearl a little better I'm not sure uh, they come up a little higher can you see that I don't know if you can see it it's really hard to tell unless you get right up on it yeah oh oh and I also did this crazy little caveman guy look how cute he is he's like a little caveman logger guy yeah <laughs> Well, time for me to be uh, moving these trucks out, and yeah, work. Well, I got one truck out of here, and um, all I got to do now is wait for uh, the owner of this truck to come pick it up. Oops, my phone went off, and in the meantime, I need to call Sun Supply. For some reason, they uh, forgot part of my order last week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, telephone. Okay, send hello. Let's see. Where are they at? That's okay, no big deal. All right, thanks. Talk to you later. See ya. Bye bye. There, it's coming in from the Portland store, and that's why it's uh, gonna be a little late, but that's okay. It's supposed to be here today. So, in the meantime, I'm gonna do a little tidying up in this shop because it's pretty messy. Woo. Ready? 